Hello everybody, Chris here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to make a time lapse inside of DaVinci Resolve 14. So the first thing you're going to need is a long, stable shot video clip. So this could be when you have a camera set up looking at the clouds and having it set to record for an hour. It could be the city streets, like we're going to do in this example. Just anywhere where the camera is looking in one direction for a long period of time and set to record is going to be the ideal shot for a time lapse. So once you have that footage and you've brought it into DaVinci Resolve, what you essentially need to do is take the video clip and drastically increase the clip speed. To increase the clip speed, we just right click on the video track after importing it into the timeline. You go to change clip speed, and then we need to take the clip speed and churn it way up. I'm going to put it at 10,000% here. I'm not even kidding, 10,000% is about where you need it. And I'm going to take ripple sequence and make sure that's turned on. The reason for that is that when you increase the clip speed a hundred times, the clip will become that much shorter on the track as long as you have ripple sequence turned on. But without ripple sequence being turned on, the duration may have some issues. So we hit change. And what will always happen is the length of the track will be reduced to correspond with the clip speed. So basically it'll become a hundred times shorter. And now if we scrub the track a little bit, you're going to see that the cars are going way fast because of course the speed has been increased. And because we have a stable shot, it's going to be ideal for the time lapse. So I'm going to export this onto the desktop and we'll take a look at how it looks. So let's go ahead and take a look playing it back. Note that um, if you're actually going to include this in one of your videos, it's probably a good idea to include music in the background or something of that nature. So that's how you would create a time lapse inside of DaVinci Resolve. Just one last thing I want to point out. Uh, if you're going to be recording footage for a time lapse, make sure that nothing happens like people walking in front of your camera like you see here, or you will get a few minor issues in your video footage. Uh, to make this video, I included some stock footage, and I'm going to include a link to the original source in the description if you're interested in that. So I've been Chris, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys in my future video content.